Hey everyone, welcome back to Linux Network. Today we've got some fresh Linux news for you and if you love KDE Plasma or if you're looking for a clean, simple and focused Linux distro, you'll want to stick around for this one. I'm talking about KaiOS 2025.05, the latest release of a small but very cool Linux distribution that's all about delivering the best possible KDE desktop experience. In this video, I'll go over what KaiOS is, what's new in this release and why it may be worth checking out especially if you like a rolling release distro that's both up to date and stable. So let's break it down. First off, for those of you who might not be familiar, let's quickly explain what KaiOS actually is. KaiOS is an independent Linux distribution meaning it's not based on Ubuntu, Fedora, Arch or any other system. It's built completely from scratch by its own development team. What makes KaiOS special is that it's focused on just one desktop environment, KDE Plasma, and one toolkit for apps, and that is Qt. So unlike most other Linux distros that give you multiple desktop environments to choose from, KaiOS keeps things simple and clean by sticking to KDE and Qt based applications only. This makes the entire system feel super consistent because all the apps and settings look and work in a similar way. KaiOS also uses the Pacman Package Manager, the same one that Arch Linux uses, which is known for being fast and efficient. And the best part? KaiOS is a rolling release distro. That means you install it once and from then on you just keep updating your system. No need to reinstall every few months when a new version comes out. But every now and then the KaiOS team puts out a fresh ISO snapshot for new installations and that's what we're talking about today, the brand new KaiOS 2025.05 release. Alright, so what's new in this latest version? Quite a bit actually. KaiOS 2025.05 is packed with updates and improvements both on the surface and under the hood. Let's start with the Linux kernel. This new release runs on Linux 6.14, one of the latest and most advanced Linux kernels available. That means better hardware support, performance improvements and security fixes built right in. Whether you've got a new laptop, a custom built desktop or even some tricky hardware, this kernel will give you the best possible support for your machine. Next up, the desktop environment. KaiOS 2025.05 ships with KDE Plasma 6.3.5. For those of you who don't know, KDE Plasma is one of the most popular desktop environments for Linux. It's known for being beautiful, fast, highly customizable and packed with useful features. Plasma 6.3.5 is part of the brand new Plasma 6 series, which brings better support for modern technologies like Wayland, improved window management and a smoother, more responsive experience overall. If you're someone who loves tweaking your desktop, moving panels around, changing themes and customizing literally every corner of your system, KDE Plasma is perfect for you. And on KaiOS, since the entire distro is built around KDE and Qt apps, everything feels super consistent and seamless. Along with Plasma itself, KaiOS 2025.5 also includes the latest KDE Gear 25.04.1 and KDE Frameworks 6.14 packages. To quickly explain, KDE Gear is a collection of official KDE apps like Dolphin, the file manager, GwenView, the image viewer, Console, the terminal, and a bunch of others. And KDE Frameworks is basically a set of libraries and tools that these apps use to function. In this release, both of these have been updated to their latest versions, bringing bug fixes, new features, and better performance. Now, here is one of the biggest changes in this release. For a long time, KaiOS included both Qt5 and Qt6 libraries because some apps hadn't yet been updated to work with Qt6. But with KaiOS 2025.05, Qt5 is finally removed from the default installation. This is a pretty big deal because Qt5 has been considered outdated for a while now and the developers believe it's time to fully move to Qt6.9, which is faster, more secure and offers better support for modern desktops. Now, if you're worried about older apps, don't panic, Qt5 is still available in the repositories for a little while longer. So if you absolutely need to install an app that hasn't been updated to Qt6 yet, you can still do it manually. But the plan is to fully remove Qt5 in the near future so developers are being encouraged to finish updating their apps. Speaking of apps, another nice improvement is that more applications now work properly with Qt6 and the latest KDE frameworks. Some of the apps that have been successfully updated include 
Fresh Cobaldi, a music notation editor. Krita, the popular digital painting app. Camoso, a simple webcam app. And Caligra Plan, a project management tool. This means that more and more of the software you may want to use on KaiOS will look better, run smoother and work more reliably on the latest tech stack. Now, let's talk about what's going on under the hood, because KaiOS 2025.05 also includes a ton of updated system components that help make your computer run better. Here is a quick list of some of the major updates. Mesa 25.1 Better graphics driver support for both AMD and Intel GPUs. PyPire 1.4.3 This one is handling audio and video streams more efficiently. Pacman 7.0 The package manager gets faster and more reliable. GCC 14.2.1 The latest version of the system compiler for building software. Systemd 254.24 Handling startup and service more cleanly. OpenSSL 3.5 Keeping your connection secure. GStreamer 1.26.1 Handling Multimedia Playback SQLite 3.49.1 Used by lots of applications internally And many more, all updated to the newest versions for better speed, security and stability Ok, so if you're interested in trying out KaiOS 2025.05, how do you get it? Well, it's super easy just head over to the official KaiOS Linux website and download the latest ISO image. You can then burn it to a USB stick using a tool like Balena Edger or Rufus and boot it on your computer to either try it in live mode or install it. If you're already using KaiOS on your system, you don't need to download this new ISO. Since KaiOS is a rolling release distro, you can simply open a terminal and run the following command. That will fully update your system to the latest version of everything we just talked about. KaiOS 2025.05 is a big and exciting release for fans of KDE and only released Linux distros. With the move to Linux kernel 6.14, KDE Plasma 6.3.5 and full adoption of Qt 6.9, KaiOS continues to be one of the cleanest, most focused KDE experience you can get on Linux. Is not for everyone. If you need GNOME, apps or love using multiple desktop environments, this probably won't be the distro for you. But if you appreciate simplicity, consistency and cutting-edge software that just works together, KaiOS is definitely worth a look. Alright, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed this breakdown of KaiOS 2025.05, be sure to leave a like and if you're new here, consider subscribing for more Linux distro overviews, news and tutorials. I'd love to hear what you think about KaiOS in the comments. Have you tried it before? Are you interested in giving this new version a shot? Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.